Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for this video, I'm going to be reviewing the Not Your Mother's Natural Tahitian Gardenia Flower and Mango Butter Line. I honestly don't know if I said that right, but like, oh well. Um, so basically before we get started, don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn the bell on Sigma so whenever I post. Whoa, I got like tongue twisted and I don't know why. Okay, so this is their curl defining lines and it is naturally derived ingredient, 98% naturally derived ingredients. So 2% is not. Um, so basically I have the curl defining shampoo. Let me do this like this. Hold on. The curl defining shampoo, the curl defining conditioner, the curl defining detangler and the curl defining combing cream. So, let me see. Hold on. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I use the combing cream last, and I used the detangler before. Wait, let me see. My dog's at my door. Um, spray on to damp hair and comb through. Style as desired. Safe for color treated hair. Work into damp hair and comb through with wide tooth comb or fingers. Reshape curls and allow to air dry or style as desired. So, I will be using both of these. The detangler first and my combing cream second. I'm always interrupted. Never fails. Um, yeah. So, right now, honestly, the last time I washed my hair was a minute ago. Like, mmm... Um, Today is Tuesday. I'm gonna say maybe Thursday I washed my hair. Maybe. Um, so yeah, my hair is quite dirty. I have my hair in a pineapple today, which is why my curls look all crazy. Okay, so I'm gonna film in the shower and out of the shower. So, I'm gonna now, I kept the conditioner on for like 10 minutes, and then I just took it off. 
So now I'm just going to, why is this coming off? Ugh, okay. Now, I'm just going to show, ooh, this curl right here is hitting different. All right, so this is really wet. Put on the suitcase. Um, like I said, I'm going to start off. Is that my scalp? Why is it so white? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Where's my phone? Is it the lighting or is it actually my scalp? It's the lighting, guys. My scalp is not white. Okay, so we're gonna spray. Let me make sure, nope. I have no idea how I would be able to like work this, to be honest. Oh wait, it says open, lift. Nope, that, that, that's not how you open it. Oh my God, there's an up thing because it's pointing to this. And this is what moves right here. This. Duh, okay. So, I'm gonna. I hear it, it's coming. It's here. Okay. So, I'm just going to put this all over. This smells really good. It smells a little bit different than the rest, but still very good. Mmm. -hmm. Oh. I should not be opening my mouth while doing this because ridiculous okay so I do use a lot when I use spray because I honestly don't know how much is actually getting on my hair so a lot shall be used and the I don't know why it looks so white oh my god because that's not how my scalp looks in person some spray did that help no. Okay. Back to just adding spray. To be honest, this camera be making me look kind of weird sometimes, you know? Sometimes it makes me look too orange. Sometimes it makes me look too white. Sometimes it makes my scalp look too white. Like, sometimes it makes my hair look way better than what it actually is. It just be going crazy sometimes, you know? Alright. Let me stop talking. So now I'm going to apply the cream. Bet. So. This is the consistency. It's a little, it's a tad runny, but not too runny. So I'm just going to apply it to all of my hair. I'm like doing like a really over the top part right here. Because I did that when my hair didn't come out the way I wanted it to. And my hair looked really good. So, we're going to experiment. Alright, so boom. These are the wet results as of right now. My hair looks scrumptious. Oh, wait, let me fix this part. All right. As of right now, my hair looks amazing, guys. Ow, that was my scalp. And before I, like, I'm done done, I just want to add a tad more cream because I did look in the regular mirror and my hair is a little bit frizzy. So I'm just going to add a tad more cream to my hair. All right, we, oh my God, my ear looked so red for a second. I was like, whoa. All right, so these are my wet results. Um, oh, let me talk about the shampoo and stuff. The shampoo was good. All the, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> all the products smell the same. Um, they smell like floral, you know, floral. Um, the shampoo had a good consistency it wasn't too thin and then it had a lot of sudsy i forgot what it's called but sudsy stuff um lather that's what it's called it had a lot of lather so definitely recommend i give it a i give it a nine because it's not a 10 like i don't know it's just not a 10 it's a nine though definitely 
Um, the conditioner was very good. Um, where is it? Here's the, picture. Here's the thing. This is how much hair it came out of my head. Right there. This is really good for me, as you guys know. I feel like I'm losing less and less hair every time. But, um, like I said, smell all the same floral. Um, the, um, what was the consistency was a thicker consistency, but not too thick that you had to apply so much. Like, okay, when I applied it to my hair, I thought I was going to need more, but then I added some water and I started, like, combing through, and it was fine. Um, yeah, so I give that a 9 out of 10, because I feel like it could have more slip. If it was a tad thinner, it could have more slip, because I have had conditioners that had more slip than that. Um, and then... What's next? Oh, the spray. This one was a... This scent was a tad more extra than the shampoo and conditioner. I gave you that. But it was a spray. I can't give you the full result until I'm done. So yeah, I'll be back when my hair is fully dry and scrunched out. Okay, guys. So this is my hair after... Not really after anything. I scrunched and everything this morning, and I went to school, and I came back. So, like, I honestly love it. There is no frizz. It is all definition and shine. Um, In the morning, I didn't really like it because it wasn't as voluminous. But as the day went on, it got more volume. Um, So, yeah. Um, I would give the spray definitely at least like an 8 out of 10 because I usually don't use sprays and this spray you can really feel it when it went into your hair and then the scent was strong but it was still good it wasn't like overpowering but it was more like it was stronger than the other scents which is why I'm giving it an 8 um and then the cream I love the cream it made my hair crunchy which I like and then I um scrunch it out so yeah, the cream I'm giving a 9 and the spray an 8. So if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn the bell so you're notified whenever I post.